uh, zinnias are common garden flowers. Yes, they make a lovely splash of colour, and yes, Nicholson has sought to investigate them, uh, interrogate them, if you like, using his weapon, his brush and his, and his paint. And what he does, and I think this is what really makes helps to make this painting such a fantastic one, is he makes something extraordinary out of the ordinary. Uh, he really, uh, I think, explores very beautifully the play of light on objects and how the objects themselves can impact on the light in turn. And this is a man who absolutely knows how to use his um, his 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 uh, paint and and, and colours his palette. Um, look at the way that it is white on white on white. This is a um, an off white glazed Chinese vase, the one on the right, on a white linen tablecloth against a white wall, and he's used the paint texturally and tonally to give you the sense of each discrete object, and yet the sort of harmony or symphony of whites plays off each other so well. But in technical terms, doing the white and white and white is pretty damn good. It was something that Colin McCann got students to do at Elam half a century later. Sometimes I wonder whether McCann could have done it himself. Well, no doubt about it, Nicholson certainly can.